say that I want to make a Google search and I want to uh, scrape all those results, I want to get all those results into my Excel uh, sheet and work with it. How do I do that in OpenRPA? Can you take us through the steps? Sure. So, so one of the main differences from, from OpenRPA and some of the other RPA solutions is that there's no magic data scraping activity. Um, so, so we kind of need to do a little work ourselves to get data out, but it also gives us a lot of flexibility in, in some ways. Yeah, say so, you want to search for, yeah, OpenRPA, that's good. So let's say we, we have just done a search on OpenRPA and I want to get out specific fields from this result. Yeah. I can then use the, the selector to easily get something inside this page. So. And when we get this, we can work ourselves back like we did before, or how do we do that? Yes. So, so the main idea here first is that we want to get and we want to get the different uh, parts of the result. So if we start by saying that I expect to get more than one result, let's say 20. And now we want to edit this selector to make sure that this selector is unique per result. So I'm going to move a little bit down here. Maybe down here. There we go. Mm -hmm. So now I got all the different results that is inside the, the, uh, the Google search. And once I do that, I can do a cute little trick where I use a get element inside another get element. So I'm going to say I'm going to search from, from the first hit that I got. I want to get something from that. Mm -hmm. So now when I open my selector, it will take the first hit it finds on the web page. And I can now nitpick and say, you know, which specific item inside that hit do I want to get something from? Yeah. Um, so for instance, if I want to get the, the, the link that was part of a, a, a result, um, this is the way that I would get that link. So if I do a right line mm -hmm. and say I want the href part of that and say give me the output. So now if I run this, I will now get the links to all the results on searching on OpenRPA. Yeah. So say that I want to save them to an Excel sheet. How do we then go on? Um, so there's a couple of ways we could do that. Um, yep. If we just want the quick and dirty way, um, that would probably be that we create a uh, we create an Excel sheet. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, by, uh, search. And now I can say that inside, so I'm going to write to a cell inside Excel. And the first thing I need to do is I need to select the, the Google sheet that we just created. Mm -hmm. And I can now say that inside cell number A and whatever index we got to uh, is where I want to save my result. So if we say that our index is one, mm -hmm. and I'm going to say that the value that I want to save is the link. Uh, do you see the error here? It's something with an integer to a string. Didn't I create that? Oh, there we go. Yeah. So I'm going to say the index needs to be added by one. And then I, of course, also need to add so, one to the index. Yeah. So index plus one, right? And plus yeah. one. There we go. And now it will uh, add all the values to the Excel sheet. Uh, 